Actor and singer Trini Lopez has passed away. He was 83. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Street Music. Lopez died of complications from COVID-19 today. Interestingly, a documentary on his life had just been completed and Lopez himself signed off on it just last week. He was born Trinidad Lopez III in Dallas, Texas. By the time he was a teen, he was already playing in bands. His first big contract was with the group The Big Beats. They signed to Columbia and recorded with Buddy Holly's producer, Norman Petty. But Lopez wanted to go solo. He got a contract with King Records. It was Frank Sinatra who saw him and signed him to his own reprise label in 1963. His first album was Trina Lopez at PJ's, where he did a cover of If I Had a Hammer, which became a global hit. Other high points included Lemon Tree, I'm Coming Home Cindy, Sally Was a Good Old Girl, Michael, Gonna Get Along With Ya, and The Bramble Bush. As an actor, he was in 1967's The Dirty Dozen with Charles Bronson, Ernest Borgnine, Lee Marvin, and Donald Sutherland. On TV, he was on Adam 12, The Hardy Boys, Nancy Drew Mysteries, and he always came across as a very likable character. May he rest in peace. Did you ever meet him? See him in concert? Favorite moments in his film career share them with us make sure you comment on our video subscribe to our channel and share our videos i'm john bowden this is rock history music mm -hmm.